how to create a PayPal smart button on your website. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how you can create your very own PayPal button on your website. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So we're going to show you how you can create a PayPal button on Wix and also on WordPress if that is your website. So let's get into it. First, we want to take a look at Wix. Now, before we begin, you will need to have a PayPal account and you will also need to purchase a upgraded account on Wix as well. So otherwise, it, you can't go ahead and add your payment method. So if we come over here underneath billing history or payment methods, right? If you open it up and here you can see we have payment methods. And if you want to add a payment method, we just simply click on add payment method. Give it a couple of seconds to load up. And here you want to select credit card or PayPal depends on you. Whatever option you select, you can go ahead and add your own card over here and you should be good to go. And then you can go ahead and buy one of these uh, premium subscriptions right here. If you want to set up your own payment section for your clients or for your customers, you need to go over here underneath in your sites right here, right? Uh, let's say this is the website, right? If we click on edit the site, and here, what we want to do is click on pages, right? It's going to open up right here. And we want to go ahead and go into store pages. And here we want to go to cart page. This is basically going to be checkout pages if you are using some other templates. Uh, for me, it says cart page, but for you, it might be different. Here, if you click on manage payments, right? Here, you can go ahead and manage your payments. I selected a different payment method, but here you will be able to add your payment methods for your customers and you can select which type of payment method would you want. First, you have to select the country in which your business operates in and then you can select any of these. If you want to go ahead and use uh, PayPal, then you have to make sure that you have a PayPal account, of course. And if you click on connect, uh, you only have to do is enter in your email address and you have these payment methods available, PayPal or pay later. And of course, uh, the currency used for your website must be the same currency as your PayPal account. So keep that in mind. For example, you have some, let's say, Australian dollars uh, for your website, but you are using the us dollars in your paypal account then it won't work so you got to make sure that you have it you have the same currency so just enter in your paypal account email below click the connect button and you'll be redirected to paypal and then you can go ahead and log into your paypal and then it will ask you to connect your account and you should be good to go it's very simple and after that you are good to go you can also use other payments methods as well so let's say if you wanted to use this one you say no i do not sell any illegal substances or stuff like that and then you just simply go ahead and select which type of payment methods you want so then if you click on continue you should be good to go and here is basically where this website asks me to go ahead and upgrade my account because wix payment is connected but it's time to upgrade our site so you can go ahead and upgrade it and you should be good to go so keep that in mind now if you want to add like a paypal button right here into your car right so let's go ahead and go into the add element section right here. Here you have the button right here, right here underneath the third option, we have button and here we have all these different options and here we have the pay buttons and we have the PayPal buttons. So they're already made. So we just have to drag and drop them as well. So right here we have PayPal button uh, application. If you want, you can go ahead and add this to your site. Uh, this will easily accept payments with your PayPal button. So you just simply agree and add it into your site. Give it a couple of seconds it's going to add all the necessary stuff and you should be good to go so right here is your paypal button but here we go so you can place it wherever you want generally uh, it should have its own section uh, if you want but let's just say we want to put it right here right uh, let me just make it a little bit smaller like so so that we don't you know go ahead and like something like that that looks good we can just put it over there now if we click on it we we'll click on settings we can go ahead and connect our payment method or our paypal account right here give it a couple of seconds okay did not load correctly so let me just try again but usually this is all it takes if you want to create your own custom uh, paypal button uh, we will show you how to do that as well so right here as you can see very simple it's open up uh, here you can go ahead and connect a stripe account as well so you can connect stripe and accept stripe payments here you can add your email right here your paypal email and here you have your settings 
payment button type if you click on it uh, you can select which type of button you want uh, payment notification is going to be over there and auto responder and everything here you have product so you have product name and all of that the design as well so here you can also get other design templates so let's say if you want this purple gradient you just simply click on it you can see it changed its color right there and if you want you have other apps as well but yeah just simply go ahead and add your email option and you should be good to go now if you want to create a custom button you can do that the exact same way so just simply click on the buttons let's say we want to add like a custom button let's say theme buttons are going to be over here this is the text icon and all of that they want to add this button right here we simply click on this button and it'll open up the settings option right here the settings panel and what do we want to do so if we click over here we link it to our paypal page over here if you already have created a specific page or my, you can go ahead and select it to that page so let's say this is the page button this is the right here so they'll be taken over here as well if you want if you already created a paypal button or paypal account you can always link these two together as well but yeah so if we click on the settings option of course this is the icon text whatever you want let's say we want the icon we can select the icon as well let me move it up over here so we can see the whole option and of course if we click on the choose link option over here we can select what we want this to do there's a bunch of different options. This is the advanced SEO, but here we have page, web page, top, email, phone number, whatever option you want, and then just select it over here and you should be good to go. And then you can go ahead and link your account or your button to your PayPal account as well. So this is one way to do it. This is how you can do it on Wix website. You can do the exact same thing with the WordPress website, but instead of adding the button right there, then and there from the options from the editor, you need to go into the plugin section right here click on add new plugin and go to the plugin store so here when we search for paypal we can see we have these options right here so there are a couple of options uh, you need to go ahead and install the woocommerce paypal for payments or payment plugin for paypal woocommerce so you have these two options if you select these two you have to create a woocommerce account and then you have to connect your paypal account to your woocommerce account and then this plugin will work if you don't want to do that we have the other options as well so like this one right here payment gateway plugin for paypal woocommerce or payment button for paypal you can go ahead and click on install now give it a couple of seconds and once it's installed you can go ahead and click on activate to activate the plugin and here we go once it's activated you should be good to go so right here we have wp paypal if we click on it give it a couple of seconds here we can go ahead and add our orders we click on settings we can go ahead and go to the settings section and here we can go ahead and connect our paypal account so we have a bunch of different options so we have paypal merchant paypal email over here currency code and all of that currency mode and over here we have the client id currency and all of that if you click on emails here you can find all the emails option as well this is the easier way to do this if you want to go ahead and add the woocommerce plugin then of course as i said before you're going to want to add the woocommerce plugin create the woocommerce account and then you can go ahead and add that plugin and you can go ahead and connect your account with it same way you would connect the paypal account with wix so there you have it that is how you do it that is how you can add your own paypal payment button on your website so thank you for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that thank you for watching and until next time take care and goodbye